are you doing today? I am here with my square hue box for the month of February? Yes, <laughs> the month of February. Um, I got this like February 2nd or 3rd, so I've had it just a few days, not too many, but here I am just now getting to recording it, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so square hue, if you don't know about square hue, it's kind of like julep, except for the bottles are bigger. You cannot customize or choose the colors that you get at all, and you really have no sneak peeks. You literally have no idea what colors you are getting beforehand. They pick a thing. They go with the theme all year. They donate a large percentage to charity. I love the company. Um, it's $14.99 plus like $5 shipping. It comes out to right at $19.99, which is exactly the cost of Julep. Um, so get both or get one of them. It's just kind of up to you. All right, so inside of our box, we have the Square Q logo. And as you, as you guys know, and as you guys know, the theme this year is the Decades Collection. They started with the 1900s um, last month. So in January, it was 1900 to 1909. And this month, it is 1910 to 1919. So um, it says the Decades Collection 1910 is when the decade is starting. And it says 215 for February 15th. Now, this is really strange. Um, on the back, it had this last month as well. It has like these um, letters that were written during the decade that are pertinent to what happened at that time, but I think they're made up letters and they're all signed by Siren. I just don't get it. I, I feel like I missed something. Anyway, um, the letter says, in the midst of war. Laura, Diana, Erica, and I have been making bandages for what seems like a million years. We walk around the neighborhood to collect cans and supplies to help the allies. Tonight, though, is going to be different. We are going out with a few GIs for a drive. We want to lift the boys' spirits. So we decided to dress in what the magazines are calling the war crinoline style. I know times are a little tough now, but together we will overcome Siren. Okay, Square Hue, if you're watching, can you please explain the siren thing to me? I don't get it. Whatever, into the polish. So inside we have our little crinkly wormies. Get rid of those, yes. And we have our wonderfully nested box so that our bottles do not slide around or roll around or spill or break or bust. And we have three colors as always. So the neat thing that they are doing this year is over here to the side is the color swatch keeper. So it gives you a little rectangle to actually paint and swatch the color right there underneath the name. And I think that's really neat. So first off, we have Tunic 1910. So you can see there on the bottom, the name of this particular color is Tunic. And it says February 15th, and this is described as a high gloss cream. So it says Tunic 1910, and it says high gloss cream. This is a beautiful peachy nude color. Really, really pretty. It's like a pastel peach, kind of. I really like that. I'm hoping it's not too sheer. I hate when there's pink polishes and you have to put like 400 coats just to see them. That's one of my biggest pet peeves. Next up, we have Cupies. Heck yeah, Cupies were so cool. Uh, 1912. I remember when I was little, I actually had like one or two Cupie dolls that like they still like made Cupies, but like they made like, you know, updated newer ones or re-released -re Cupie dolls or whatever. I actually had a Cupie doll when I was little. I have no idea where it is. Um, so it says Cupies 1912 and this is like a pink, almost uh, baby pink pastel uh, flesh tone for Cupies. So there it is. Kind of boring. These are kind of boring, just like pink PT tones. Nothing too exciting. This one though, I really like. So this one is the War Crinoline. Um, or War Crinoline, sorry, 1915. This is also described as a high gloss cream. So all three of the, so all three of these are described as a high gloss cream finish. And this is a very pretty, really nice army green color. Really pretty. And I like, 
cream polishes so I'm super excited um, I don't like sheer polishes at all they literally drive me nuts so I'm actually excited that they are all three cream polishes although I wonder if these take multiple multiple coats to see them because sometimes your pink baby pinks do that so anyway those are the three polishes that I got in the decades collection 1910 square hue box so let me know what you guys think and I will see you in the next video bye